Hello, this is Vasavi from At Home Tuition. So in this video we are going to learn how to prove the converse of basic proportionality theorem. So it is just the opposite, the reverse of the basic proportionality theorem. If a line divides any two sides of a triangle in the same ratio, then the line is parallel to the third side. In the proportionality theorem, we learned that if the lines are parallel, then it divides in the same ratio, right? Here it is just the converse of what we learned in BPT. So here they say, if a line divides the two sides in the same ratio, both the sides, it should be the same ratio. In that case, the line is parallel to the third side. So what is given here? Again, we need to note down the two aspects here. One is what is given and the other one is what you need to prove. So, here what is given is the two sides of the triangle is divided in the same ratio, right? So, here the sides, I have taken the triangle as ABC and uh, you have a line DE so that the D cuts AB at some point and E cuts AC at a point, right? Okay. Now, here the, the ratio is like the ratio of the sides is like AD over DB is equal to the other side. Second side is AE over EC. Right? So this is what is given. They say that the sides are here. This one is given. The line divides the side in same ratio. That is given. And you need to prove that the line is parallel to the third side. So to prove is the line, the line is D is parallel to the third side, okay? Third side is BC, right? Okay, so this is what we need to prove. So to prove this, what I do is, let me first assume another point E I have already marked it here. Another point E dash. Okay. And let us assume that DE is not parallel to BC. Okay. So this is your assumption. So uh, we would take another point that is E dash. Okay. And um, let us assume that DE dash, D, the line DE dash is parallel to BC. So we make this assumption and let now what we are going to do is we are going to show that our assumption is not right. Okay. And so we say that DE is actually parallel. If DE dash is parallel to BC then as per the BPT theorem if this is right then you say that AD over db is equal to ae dash over e dash c and the reason here is the bpt theorem right bpt the basic proportion as per the basic proportionality theorem uh, we know that if two lines are parallel then it is you can frame this ratio it is proportional the sides are proportionate okay now since we have got AD by DB equals AE dash by e, e dash C and already it was given like uh, AD, AD by DB is AE by uh, EC, right? I can say AE by here this given one, okay? This is equation 1. Let me take that as equation 1 and this one as equation 2. So from 1 and 2 I get this. Because in 1 they say AD by DB equals AE by EC, right? And here we say that in second equation we say AD by DB. The same AD by DB is equal to AE dash by E dash C. So from 1 and 2 I can say AE by EC is equal to AE dash over e dash c okay now adding one to both sides just add one to both sides this becomes ae over ec 
plus 1 equals AE dash over E dash C plus 1. Okay. Since here the, in the left hand side the denominator is easy. I can just make this as AE over EC to get uh, same uh, denominator on on both side on this side too okay this one I will just make it as EC over EC okay so that is one right I take EC because the denominator over here is EC and the same way here it is AE dash over E dash C right so this one also I can just take it as E dash C over E dash C. That is nothing but 1 again. Right? Now, if you solve this, you get the denominator is same. Right? And AE plus EC is AB. Just look at the, look at the picture here. AE plus EC is AC. Right? So, I write that as AC here. AC by EC is equal to AE dash plus E dash C is also AC only. So AC by E dash C. Okay. Did you get that? I just put these two. I just added the numerators. It's just normal fraction addition. Okay. So from this what do you get? If it has to be 0, these two has to be equal, your numerator is already equal. But uh, the denominator is supposed to be equal now, right? This implies EC C is equal to E dash C, right? This is possible only if E and E dash are same. So this is contradictory to our assumption, right? I give you the reason because... E is not equal to E dash. Okay. So this is this statement is false. Therefore D E dash parallel to B C is not right. Okay. That implies D E is parallel to B C. Okay. So our assumption is not right. Only this is possible. So proved. I repeat this once again. You take the triangle and you just mark and point a point E dash on AC and say that DE dash is parallel to BC. Okay. If the lines are parallel then the sides are proportional. So you would have if as per the BPT theorem you can say that AD by DB is equal to AE dash by E dash C. But already it is given AD by DB is AE by EC. So from 1 and 2 I can just equate that AE is over EC is equal to AE dash divided by E dash C. I just added 1 to both sides so that I got when I solved it using the fraction addition. I got AC by EC is equal to AC over E dash C. Since the numerators are equal, the denominators are to be equal. That is EC uh, should be equal to E dash C. But from the picture you can see that this is not right in this picture. So it is contradictory to our statement, our assumption. Uh, because it can be equal only if E and E dash are same. So we say that DE is equal to PC.